She has been saying it though. She has been saying it from the very beginning that Olori Toby Philip is not pregnant. Okay, now what we are hearing is that allegedly Olori Mariam don't come out to Gidibam to say that only of Ife should should not waste a minute more that he should take Toby's babies for DNA tests. Hey, hey, no be small thing. And people have been saying that this picking never arrived. Or just they, they have not stayed for two days, every three days. May, may Mariam be coming down. Mariam, calm down. Even if any, any of you will go for DNA test, not immediately. Anyway, shall my people, let me welcome you officially. You're welcome back to my channel. I greet you according to your time. And according to the time you are seeing this video, how are you doing? I hope you are good. We are still on the gist from the palace of Oni of Ife. Hey, hey, you know, be smart, you know, the thing where they happen this time around, you know, even funny. Because I don't know how a, a mother that just gave birth would be feeling uh, pains in her, in her body. And, would, and the Olori Marian wouldn't let her rest. A journey of nine months is not a, a, a thing of when you come back, people will start saying a lot of things. I even thought that Olori uh, Toby have went to Olori Mariam to beg her. Hey, maybe oh, maybe oh, because I will always tell you an alleged information. It, if he be saying that this kind of thing where they happen right now, that Olori Toby went to Mariam to beg because a fellow woman go know what fellow woman know now. As Mariam there, so Toby go know what him Mariam know, and the Mariam go know what him Toby know because two of them are the same. If I say are the same base of the same feather now, I don't know how people are going to understand it. Sure, they are best of the same feather because they know what each other know. Is is bef it has been long we we, uh, we used to see Olori Toby as being innocent, but recently she just proved herself that she's not. She come innocent. So she knows what Mariam knows. If it be this thing where Mariam they talk right now, that Olori Toby went to beg her, beg her for that time they said that they caught her kneeling down before, uh, before Mariam, begging Mariam for something. And the new affair called her and started, she started saying that uh, she had been insulting Mariam, she wants to beg her forgiveness so that Mariam will stop coming to her dream and all of that. So my people, the thing where will they hear this time around be say, hmm, Olori Mariam, oh, she don't go meet on your affair. Tell on your face, say, without wasting time, go and carry these babies and do DNA tests to know if actually you are the father or these babies are the RNG that I knew Olori Toby was planning before now. Hey, 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 my people. Oh. Okay, according to what people have been saying, people have been telling Olori Mariam to calm down. Because in Ileife culture and tradition, allegedly what we heard though, that the king will not see these babies until after three good months. The king are not going to see the babies until after three months. And this is exactly why uh, Olori Toby wanted to go to Lake Mansion and stay with Queen Naomi. Even if Narenji baby. Or na normal pregnancy, who knows? We don't know. But this is exactly the reason why uh, Toby wanted to go to Lake Mansion and stay with Queen Naomi, so that because she she too she not even want to know if to be visiting Queen Naomi, so that because say uh, Onye will not come there to see Queen Naomi or uh, to see the baby, she will stay there. Uh, after three months, she uh, Onye will not see the baby. Because she doesn't want any other place that she will stay. People will start saying a lot of things, but and other other others will have access to that place. You know, say not all, not be all the Oloris they enter that lucky mansion. As long as Kunomi is there, they have people that go that visit there. It's, uh, it's like only Doctor Elizabeth that even visit there this time around because Demitobe don't uh, don't. Uh, it's like Demitobe have done something that made Onyefe to stop to prevent her from going that to that lucky mansion. Actually, don't do not visit that place at all at all. Um, where are they? All of them, Mariam, is it Mariam? Her own, uh, she, she, she cannot even visit that place, even in the dream. So, my people, oh, <laughs> now this thing where Olori Toby talked of, then she was saying that she wants to go and stay with Queen Nomi until she give birth, that she wants prayers. Now, only of you, they are 
Olori Mariam is hitting it. In short, she's not even resting. She's very, very, very busy saying that Daniel Fe should go and do DNA tests before that three months. But it's not possible that Daniel Fe will see this baby because according to their tradition, only will not see the baby. So how is it going to happen? Even if they want to fake anyway, I don't just know. If they want to fake something now, it's, it's, even if, if it's now that they will even fake it. Because they might go and do, uh, a lot of people might go and sort them. And they will do DNA tests and it will show that it is uh, only of your first own with fake one. But a lot of things have been happening. You know, in short, see comments where they see for this place. Some people we, have, we, uh, we are saying that if actually these babies are not phony, that the babies are not going to survive it. Let's sure make Toby no even waste waste her time trying to say that this child, this children belongs to Nyo Fife. Because if it is not Onyo Fife's children, any man that will cross Toby or anybody and Toby gets pregnant and give birth, that that's, those children or that child will not survive it in that palace. And again, I, don't, I think that thing they did, uh, Onyo Fife did. Uh, traditionally, for to, for Lori Naomi, is it that he did not do it for these Loris? I don't know because you hear on your face saying that if they if they don't want to stay, they don't want to marry again because he's going after Queen Naomi. Let them just go their way, and he's ready to release them freely. Or more, I don't even understand what I understand this time around. <laughs> Seriously, I don't know what I'm I'm going to uh, believe this time. But what is the cocoa now? The cocoa here be say, only of if Mariam have been advising only of to, for him to carry this student and go DNA test as fast as possible before the three months go even uh, elapse. Mm -hmm. Before the three months go finish, may only of know whether the student are his student. So if he, if he is rejoicing, let him rejoice from the depth of his heart. And if the student are not his own. Let him start right away to react. That is exactly what to, uh, Mariam is saying. Because Mariam started from the very beginning to say that Olori Toby Philip is not pregnant. And there was a time we heard that uh, the man that, that was giving Toby drugs that is making her tummy to come out, that the man stopped giving Toby drugs. And Toby was hospitalized then. Oh, my, <laughs> hey, I don't know what to believe again, though. No. Anyway, my people, don't forget that they are all alleged information. No. But if if actually uh, Toby have these children from Oni of Ife, I think Marian will be in shame. Oh. Seriously. Marian will be in, in a very big mess and shame. The greatest shame of her life. That is what she's going to receive. Because she has vowed that Toby will not rest. Because of say Toby said that she is pregnant. And the people that have been believing Marian have been believing Marian. Some people are believing Toby that she's pregnant. We don't know which one to believe again. What I know is that after three months, because I don't think any of you would like to see these children as tradition demand, after three months, we'll know whether these children are only of your face or not. Thank you so much for listening. And don't, uh, don't forget that they are all alleged information. Give this video a thumbs up. I love you guys. Bye.